Basra in the south and just some of the thousands of Iraqis who've responded to a call by the country's most influential Shiite cleric to take up arms against a Sunni Muslim insurgency. Local religious leaders encourage the would-be recruits to the Iraqi army, facing danger even before they start fighting, with reports of a deadly mortar strike at a recruitment center in central Iraq. We've answered a call to go to Samara, which has been liberated, and we'll go to Mosul to liberate it from ISIL members who are traitors and have no religion. They're neither Sunnis nor Shiites. Insurgents from ISIL, the Islamic State of Iraq and the Levant, have captured swathes of territory, including the country's second biggest city, Mosul. But after days of lightning advances, government forces have regained some territory in counterattacks. The defense ministry released this footage, saying it showed airstrikes on Sunni militant targets in the north. In Kirkuk, Kurdish forces are now in control. They too have been fighting ISIL. Meanwhile, the U.S. is reviewing military options, short of sending troops to combat the insurgency, while Iran has offered its help to Baghdad if a formal request is made.